take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Why did the United States decide to enter the war and fight on the side of allies? Wilson could not keep America out of war so they fought on the side of the allies. Germany kept on being aggressive, ships invading Belgium, etc. This made America join the British. Let's help you make your mark. Submarine warfare in the Atlantic kept tensions high, and Germany's sinking of the British ocean liner Lusitania on May 7, 1915, killed more than 120 U.S. citizens and provoked outrage in the U.S. in 1917. Germany's attacks on American ships and its attempts to meddle in U.S.-Mexican relations drew the U.S. into the Let's help you make your mark. The entry of the United States was the turning point of the war, because it made the eventual defeat of Germany possible. It had been foreseen in 1916 that if the United States went to war, the Allies' military effort against Germany would be upheld by U.S. supplies and by enormous extensions of credit. Make your mark, take our lead. The United States had 4,355,000 military personnel involved in World War I. The U.S. Navy played a major role in helping to blockade Germany, keeping out supplies and hurting Germany economically. The U.S. forces that were sent to Europe during World War I were called the American Expeditionary Forces, AEF. Let's help you make your mark. The United States did not enter the war until its late stages because it wanted to maintain neutrality. U.S. citizens were divided in their support of the Allies and the Central Powers, and business leaders wished to protect trading relationships on both sides. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.